Hypnosis is an altered state of consciousness in which a person becomes highly suggestible. It can make people believe their actions are occurring involuntarily, reduce feelings of pain, and change brain activity in observable ways. Despite popular media portrayals, people can't be hypnotized against their will, but hypnosis can lead to the creation of false memories and other cognitive trickery. Exactly how this works has been the topic of debate. According to sociocognitive theories, hypnosis is a social role in which people hand over responsibility for their actions to the hypnotist. According to dissociation theory, hypnosis presents an altered state in which consciousness is split into two components, a hypnotized component, the hypnotized self, and a non-hypnotized component, the hidden observer. The hidden observer maintains accurate perceptions of the world, while the hypnotized self is highly suggestible. Dissociation theory applies to age regression in hypnosis, which can occur when an adult is hypnotized and instructed to recall an event from the past. Even as the hypnotized self recalls an event from childhood, the hidden observer remains aware of actually being an adult. This phenomenon applies to the Pagendorf illusion, which involves the misperception of one part of a line running through an intersecting shape. Adults are more susceptible to this illusion than children. However, an adult experiencing age regression during hypnosis still perceives the illusion as an adult and not as a child. <laughs>